Okay, so we're here with Jakob Odgaard and Rune Scove. We wanted to ask some questions about uh, the team here that set up the Griffin Kodo system. And the first one is, tell us about what Griffin is doing in the United States and how you came to uh, do this install of this wonderful Kodo system. Yeah. Um, we are, we have, we have a long history in, in US, actually, mm -hmm. but uh, um, it was only until last year we really created a strategy for our presence in, in the US by establishing a, a fully owned, flat, fully fledged uh, subsidiary, mm -hmm. Griffin Audio North America Inc. And um, since then we have been focusing on, on uh, the market, of course, p the products suited for this market, and also setting up the logistics system, partnering up with uh, Anthony Chiarella, and uh, it has uh, really surprised us how well uh, things are moving uh, here. Um, so um, it's uh, it's looking good, and we are very happy with uh, how things develop. Great. So you're sitting in front of the Kodo speaker system, which is obviously mid-tweeter tower and a giant base tower. And just for, for scale of our readers, this is some eight feet tall towers here. But you also have the Apex amplifier and you have the Commander preamplifier, brand new flagship products, as is the Kodos. Yeah. Can you tell us a little bit about what you feel differentiates them in the market? What's different about the Kodos and, and the Apex and the... And the commander what i think is that the Kodo system is is fairly unique system it is not just a statement system everyone can make a statement system but it's also nice to make a speaker system that will actually sell and 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 you know put our brand out there uh in a lot of different markets um the Kodo system is special because it is a four tower system uh, four-way system uh, the base towers they are sem uh, semi or they are active so it's a semi-active system we are talking about so only the mid-range and tweeter tower you see behind Jakob here uh, that's passive and it's powered by the apex in this system um, working with um, uh, semi-active systems is something we've been doing for a long time mm -hmm. uh, but with the Kodo system, I think we took the next step uh, in terms of uh, speaker manufacturing, speaker design, uh, the engineering behind it, also the whole engineering behind the packaging, everything, how it comes. Uh, it is quite unique because it takes like eight big crates um, and you have to build it on the ground and so on. Um, it's a uh, shipping weight 1.3 ton uh, so, so it's a it's a heavy system uh, but it's also a unique system and I think that when you have something like this you should be able to play all types of music um, mm -hmm. and and delivering this system for Hugh it has been something very special um, and and in this beautiful color you know it's just wow uh, so beautiful uh, of course, the Apex and Commander that you see here as well, uh, they are the first Apex and Commander shipping from Griffin. Um, it is the first system of that caliber to be installed in a private home. Uh, that's also the reason why we're here and because we are running our own distribution company mm -hmm. uh, under the lead leadership of Anthony Chiarella. Mm -hmm. um, so we decided to come here uh, to help set up the system um, and having Apex here, which is the state of art amplifier for Griffin. It is the biggest project ever. Um, it was a matter of telling Tom, who is the chief designer, now you're gonna do what it takes to build the best amplifier on the planet. You know, don't think about the cost, don't think about the time, just do it. Do whatever you think is the best possible solution and the best possible design. And it was the same with the Commander preamplifier. Um, we took the time 
the necessary resources to build what we think are the most unique uh, electronic products in the luxury high-end audio industry. Um, and it has just been a joy setting it up here and getting it to play and see the excitement from from Mr. Nanadi mm -hmm. and you know it's it's just been great. So, and like most Griffin products it's pure class A. It is. It and is. a massive amount of power I would imagine. Oh yeah. Mm -hmm. uh, for the Apex stereo we are talking about 210 watts per channel pure class A. We are talking more than 1 million microfarad power capacity so it's more than one farad. Um, it's a massive beast, 450 pounds of weight. Uh, but for those of you who watched the video on, on, on TAS yesterday, you can actually see that one guy can put it on to the standard Apex Amp stand by using this special cloth. So you can get it out of the box on your own and slide it on to the Amp stand, yep. which is fairly unique. So it doesn't take yeah. 20 people to move it around. Um, so it's a, it's a, it's a, it's a cool, cool thing. Uh, it is the next level for, for Griffin, that's for sure. And so it's really been interesting to be here. Hugh's got a purpose built building for listening, which in and of itself is un, unusual, but what are your impressions of the, the room? Uh, he's had acoustics from Dennis Foley and you, you guys have had a chance to listen to it now. It's been breaking in, you know, from cold, but. Yeah, you, you it's a great room. Yeah, it's, it's, it's a magnificent room. When you enter the room, you feel the ambience immediately. And you feel that this room, that's a place where you can actually create incredible sound. Um, and I think we have achieved that yeah. over the, the last two days with the tweaking and setting up the system. I think we have to admit that this room is better than the one we have in, in the factory yeah. as of now. Yes. yes. Yeah, it's a it's a brilliant, brilliant. Uh, I, I'm sure we we can you know we can go down the same road at the the factory. We have a very good listening room, but this one is Even very now. this is this is unique, um, and it's so easy to work with uh, because the system responds to everything you do. Um, so it actually it makes the setup quite easy to do. Um, and we, we spoke about it last night and, and I was very, very happy even with cold products right out of the, of the crates, brand new products, not broken in, nothing that, that, you know, I'm on behalf of Griffin, very proud of what we have achieved with this system and especially the performance. It's, uh, it's something very special. It's probably one of the best systems that I've ever uh, been doing this setup. Well, well, thanks so much, guys. Really appreciate you sharing some thoughts. And thank you so much for your time. You're very welcome. You're welcome.